What's going on, everybody? Josh Engelman for awesomeo.com, and I am back with my NFL DFS contenders on FanDuel for Monday Night Football. Almost said Sunday. For Monday Night Football, Saints and Seahawks. Now, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you know when everything goes live. Head to Twitter and follow me, at Josh Engelman. Hop into the comments underneath this video. Let me know who your favorite and least favorite contenders are for today's slate. And finally, shout out to No House Advantage for being the presenting sponsor of this video. Use the promo code AWESOMO when signing up. Get a $25 instant match deposit bonus. We round out the bottom of my top 10 with Traquan Smith, Jason Myers, Alex Collins, Tyler Lockett, and Marquez Callaway on the outside looking in. Who will be my favorites? My top five plays for today? It is time to find out. First up at number five, we've got DK Metcalf, 13,500, projected for 11 fantasy points. Seattle is a four-point underdog against the Saints, 41 and a half point total. It's the number 23 offense at PFF against the number 8D. There's a 5% chance that DK Metcalf just breaks the slate and goes for more than 25 fantasy points. A 9% likelihood to be the optimal MVP, plus another 32% at the flex. That gets DK Metcalf to 41% likelihood to be in the optimal. He's basically packed in with Tyler Lockett and with Marquez Callaway. We take a little bit of a step up to number four and sort of three, then we jump up to two, and then we shoot out of a cannon all the way to number one. Kenny Stills is in at number four. He's just 5,500, projected for 5.8 fantasy points. Saints, four-point favorites here. The number 21 offense, which is kind of pitiful. The number 20 defense, which is kind of surprising to me still. 1% chance that Kenny Stills is the optimal MVP. That's not why you go here. You go here for the savings at the flex. 45% likelihood that Kenny Stills is in your optimal lineup there's no reason to overthink this. You're not going to find a better way to save salary today than Kenny Stills. Under center for Seattle, we're going to Geno Smith. He's 14K, yikes. Projected for 14 fantasy points. He is what he is here. 5% likelihood to go for more than 25. A 10% chance to be optimal at MVP. Plus another 42% at the flex spot. You get Geno Smith in an optimal coin flip. 50-50 shot that Geno Smith is in the optimal. That's pretty scary given his salary right now. I certainly like getting to him, but he's the guy that you really want to pay close attention to for the ownership and be very aware of what you have in the lineup with him. Uh, you've got Metcalf at 41%, Lockett at 39%, so 240% wideouts plus Geno Smith at 50. It's a scary Seahawks stack giving, given this 41 point total, but even still, because of the floor of quarterbacks, Geno Smith still comes in at number three. Now at number two, we've got Jameis Winston. He is 16,500, projected for 16 and a half fantasy points. Four point favorites here. The odds that Winston has a bigger game, certainly a little bit bigger than you would expect out of Geno Smith. 13% chance for Winston to go for more than 25. You get a 22% likelihood at the MVP. Tack on another 40% at the flex. It's quite clear here, Geno Smith is well ahead, or Jameis Winston is well ahead of Geno Smith, and he's well ahead of every other player on this slate, except for my number one, who is the clear cut, no doubt about it, no brainer number one play on FanDuel today. Before we get to that number one guy, one last reminder, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, notification bell so you know when everything goes live. Off to Twitter, go follow me, at Josh Engelman, into the comment section underneath this video. Only place that you can let me know who your favorite and least favorite contenders are. And finally, again, shout out to No House Advantage for sponsoring this video. It's not even particularly close. Alvin Kamara at 16K is your number one contender on FanDuel today. 20.7 fantasy point projection. I don't see Seattle really slowing him down, and he's involved in every facet of this offense. 32% likelihood that he goes for more than 25 fantasy points. A 49% chance he's the optimal MVP. That is a massive number. Uh, so much, I mean, 49% is more than Kenny Stills is in the optimal. This dude is in everything. I didn't even mention the fact that he's in 32% of flex lineups. No matter what you're doing, Alvin Kamara is unquestionably the number one contender for today. Alrighty, folks, that will do it. Those are my NFL DFS contenders on FanDuel for Monday Night Football Saints and Seahawks. There's a DraftKings version of this video around here somewhere. Go check that out. Good luck tonight, everybody. Win some cash. I will be back again on Thursday for another edition of The Contenders.